How did you deal with Nigerians? And you know how we are now. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> they call you a shewu, they yes. do this, you they do, do that. You know? My late ex-husband, yeah. he met me as a dancer. Yeah. He was very okay with it. But you know, because people talk, yeah. the dancer say, my wife can't be a dancer. If my wife can't be a dancer, then I can't be your wife. Simple. Because that's what you met me doing, yes. you know. So it was not a bit; it was very challenging. Very challenging, yes. My sister and I we stuck it out. Right. When my sister passed away, mm -hmm. uh, Funke joined us. And mm. 2018, you got engaged. So they were waiting for the. Was it 2018? No, it's... I was 55 then. No. Yes. 2016. Yes, yes. 55th birthday. Yes, 2016. Why did you announce the engagement? I and... didn't announce it. Yes. It was a surprise party. Right. And it was at that party that still now says. So uh, he gave me his mom's ring and that right. he wants to en be engaged. Yeah. And we hadn't talked about it, him and I hadn't talked about it. So it's going to be the longest engagement in history. That's what you said. You said it's when you are 100 or so. That's no, it. I said 75. <laughs> ah, <thank> you. <laughs> you know, I, I see a lot of videos where uh, the woman will go and attack the other woman. What's your one? If she beats you, uncle. <laughs> then you're not about two things. <laughs> I used to have a boss who used to say, when people would say, oh, somebody snatched somebody's husband. She'd be like, is the husband a piece of paper? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. And if it's big enough for you to leave your own husband, mm -hmm. the, what says that the next husband you marry will not cheat? So you'll all be going from husband to husband to husband. <laughs> Are you saying that the way that your dad handled women was good? You know, he has been accused of misogyny. He has been accused of all oh, some of the songs, the lifestyles, the women. What's your take on that? The women agreed to marry Fela. They had a choice mm. not to. Mm. If they married him and he married them, mm. they both made that choice. The, the, the two groups made that choice. I'm not here to judge them. I'm not yes. God. Yeah. For me, like growing up with Fela made me realize that polygamy does exist, mm. can exist. Was there something in your upbringing that made you like that? where it looks like things don't move you, it looks like you're not easily impressed, it looks like you're just living your own life on your own terms, whether you're a celebrity or people know your last name, it doesn't really matter to you. Ah, you are asking me difficult questions. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the greatest lesson I learned from his passing, as I was 12 or so, I think it was 1997, people forget that he either died on the same day as Princess Diana, I was worried. I'm like, people are going to forget <laughs> Fela because of Diana's death. Because as a 12 year old child, I wrote two books one in tribute to Diana, one in tribute to Fela. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know? And I just thought people are going to forget Fela. And oh, it's so it's unfair. Oh, it's just what kind of unfortunate thing is this. And then time passes, and you realize that the work that the person does can never be swallowed by the life of another person. Mm. Now, everybody, all the musicians, if they just pull off one shoe, they say they are fella. Ah, everybody is fella. Everybody is fella except fella's children. <laughs> Their marriage, I think that it was a um, communication breakdown. Right. Because Funke even now says if she had known then what she knows now, mm. she'd probably never have left the marriage, mm. you know? So I think it was just a communication. And you, you know, I you need to know our people. Our people, we, are, we can be very devilish. If you see something that is good, mm. it's how you will bring it. That you will not focus on, that you will focus uh, bring on. Bring it down. Yeah. You know, so a lot of people would have been talking to her, mm. you know. They, I mean, it's just like me. Like, I'm telling you that people are saying, why are you still dancing for your brother? Like, ah, form your own band. Which band do I want to form? Did I, did I ever come and meet you that I want to form a band? Is there anything from that that you learned that has changed the way that you parent or that changed the way that you co-parent? Well, my daughter definitely did not call me by my name. <laughs> First and foremost. First and foremost. <laughs> I am mommy. Yes. I, I am not your friend. I am your mommy. Right. Uh -huh. So Femi was a musician. Femi was um, following in the footsteps of his dad. Mm. Showing the same thing. Mm. So they were pitting. Then they were not only pitting Femi against his father. They were pitting Femi and Shemu yes, against yes. each other. Yeah. Femi and Fela used to have a battle. <laughs> and Femi would, you know. We'll give it to him straight. Straight. Uh, so La and I were like timid. We just the same. When two elephants are fighting, the grass is keeps quiet. <laughs> and one is the grass keeps quiet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. Ah, so we just used to... Uh, Fela was very intimidating. Yeah. 
you know, because if I open eye like this for you, uh, you, you, you don't even have to say Same a word. Thing. You start shaking. Yeah. You start shaking me. Eh? What? Ah, you just <laughs> turn to jelly wherever you are. So it was. I remember when um, he was dying. We, we knew that he was dying. Uh, so we were looking after him. And then if, if, if you do something, he, he couldn't even talk, but you just open his eyes and look at you. Whatever you are doing, you just stop it. You know, so, I mean, we, we didn't take him to hospital until he gave the approval. Thinking of the legacy, I want to talk about celebration, you know, which mm -hmm. you conceptualize according, you know. Mm -hmm. But before that, I just want to ask something, and I have so many things to ask you. And we spent the first part of the reason I've been talking about, you know, your father and your father and your father. Does it get tiring? <laughs> It can. Yeah. It can get tiring. I will not lie to you, it was not easy. Mm -hmm. When we now took up the mantle by ourselves, it, it wasn't easy. I didn't really know how to approach sponsors. I didn't know. Are you happy? What do you think? 